In this video, I'm going to show you how to take a snapshot in LumaFusion. If you saw my video on how to make thumbnails in InShot, the thumbnail text was actually created as a title inside LumaFusion. Let's get started. The first thing you'll need to do is open LumaFusion, whether it's on your phone or your iPad. In this case, I'm using my phone because this will just be a quick edit. Then open a new project by tapping on the new project icon and tap the icon in the upper right hand corner. You can name the project if you want, but you don't need to. Once you've got your new project open, you want to tap on the flower in the corner and find the media that you want to use. In this case, I'll be using a preset title I created for my thumbnail text. I use this text on all of my thumbnails. Double tap your clip to open the clip editor. Then make sure Titles is selected and select your text. When you see the keyboard, you can change the text. This title template says Photo Cutout Tool, but I'm doing an InShot tutorial on the Photo Cutout Tool in the video section. So I'm going to change the text from Photo Cutout Tool to Video Cutout Tool. Just long press on the space bar, move the cursor to where you want it, let go, and then make your change. Once you've made your changes, tap on the left facing arrow in the upper left hand corner to go back to the main timeline, and you can take a look at your new title layer. Pinch and zoom to resize and reposition the layer as needed. LumaFusion is a video editor, not a photo editor. However, if you tap on the export icon, you can tap snapshot to take a still image of whatever is in the preview window. Once I'm done, I'll go back to InShot and you'll see that I have a photo in the photo section that I just created in LumaFusion. Import the photo into InShot and position it like this. Make sure the picture in picture panel is open and it should be the topmost layer in the stack. To remove the black background, inside InShot you can select the text layer and use the blend option instead of the chroma key because the blend option works better.